Hello and welcome to today's video. In today's video I'm going to talk to you about a new feature within Excel in the Office 365 suite. So for years we've been able to share Excel files. Traditionally that was done using there was a share option in the earlier versions of Excel on the review ribbon. Um, that has now been changed and now what we have is the ability to save files into our OneDrive or into a SharePoint document library and that makes them shareable. The big downside to that is, is when multiple people are working on it, it's not necessarily been a, a really good environment to work in. It's not been as good as say Google Sheets has had it in the past. Obviously we've been able to see when there's another person in the spreadsheet and we can even see as I'm demonstrating here where that person is within that spreadsheet. The big problem has been when we've tried to work on a spreadsheet together and there's been filters in place. So as an example, if I show you, that's the other person's view of the Excel spreadsheet. If I now go and put a filter on it, and if I go back to their view now, you will see their screen has the same filter on. So it can be quite annoying and you know gets in the way of it being productive to use that spreadsheet. Now if I go back to the original spreadsheet and let's put it back to showing everything under the, the view ribbon now you'll see the beginning of the view ribbon now has the sheets view. So if I press new you'll see straight away you'll know when you're in the sheets view because the letters and the numbers down the side go inverted now. So if I put a filter on you'll see that filter is now on my screen, but if I go to the other person's view, they don't suffer from that filter. Now if I go back here, I can actually save these views for future use. So if I decide I wanna call that, I'm gonna call this Maxwell, and I press keep now, I can revert back to the full view just by going to default. And if I go for Maxwell, you'll see it changes. And the good news there is if you were doing some analyzing and checking of a spreadsheet and you wanted uh, a colleague to see the same thing, you can now say to them, just look at my view. And if you go to, I'm in the web version here, sheet views, they can then pick the Maxwell one and see exactly what you're seeing on your screen. So a major improvement compared to what we had before, a real game changer and it does actually bring us closer to what Google Sheets has had for, for many years. Now, if you wanted to change those views or you wanted to duplicate them and, and then modify a duplicated version, under the options, we've got that ability. We can rename these views, we can duplicate them, we can even delete them from there when, we, when we're done. Okay, guys, a nice quick video there today. Um, if you enjoyed it, can you give me a thumbs up? And if you want to see more videos from me, please remember to press the subscribe button and click the notification bell because when I put a new video out there, YouTube will let you know. Thank you for watching guys and I will see you in the next video.